So let's add some column filtering to this. We can sort by clicking on our sort headers, but what if we want to actually filter this data out? Well, there's an easy way to do that in AppMaker. First, let's open up the widget panel, and we'll scroll down and we'll find a vertical panel. Let's drop that into the top of the header panel up here, right in front of models. And one thing that might be really handy is to turn on the outlines so you can see the outlines of your different widgets while they're on the page. Now let's go ahead and drag over the model and just drop it right into that vertical panel. Great. Now what we want to do is take a text box, drop it right below the model label, and we can change its variant to search content so that it puts that little magnifying glass in there so we know it's a search box. And now here's the important step. We'll go over here to value and we'll click on more options and then we want to choose data source query filters and then model and we want this one to we just want to tar type part of it so we'll just select, select contains click ok and we have to do one more thing here which is reload the data source so we'll scroll down here to this on value change and click reload data source now let's give that a quick preview all right, now when we type into the search box here and hit enter, we get a searched list for our data. Let's just repeat that step one more time here, and we'll do it on the color column this time. So once again, we'll drag in another vertical panel, move over that color label, and then we're going to um, drop in a text box. Once again, we're going to set it to uh, search content and then set its value. We'll do this process one more time. Select binding, select more options. And then we're going to select data source, query, filters, and this time color. And we want this to be precise, so we'll say equals. Click OK. Go down here and change the on value change to reload data source. And I noticed that our labels are kind of off a little bit up here in the header. So if we select those, we can, we can actually select all of them. And then go down here into the layout panel over here in the properties editor and choose a line top. That moves them all up there, so they look good. All right, now they're all lined up. Let's try out our color search a filter. Red, that's great. And then you can see we can also sort a filter on multiple columns here. So if we type in the LE, we just get the one record. All right, and there's your quick tip for the day. And please be sure to join us at appmakeruniversity.com for more great information on how to use AppMaker.